So, so when we got home, uh, got here yesterday, last night, middle of the night, pretty late, pretty early in the morning, kind of. Uh, we unloaded some of the bedding stuff that we needed for the night, and then we parked the U-Haul right here. So, from the truck, that is their new home. Half of that is the their new residence. I'll take and show you through it. So, this is the front face of the house. It's, it's a duplex, so there's that half. And then there's this half. This is the half that they're that they're moving into. Uh, the first thing we were stunned by, we had seen a Google, you know, uh, maps walk around with some of the graphics stuff they had. First thing that we were all amazed by was when we came and went inside. Everything, the rooms, everything is huge. This is their side. This is where they're living. It's got an upstairs, downstairs. And this is the from front to the back, and it seems it's bigger than it seems in the pictures. But uh, it's got nice. It's got lots of windows. It's got a bay area, and inside it's like a big living area. There's a bay window with a bench seat, and uh, it's really cool. Front to back, there's this going back here. It goes all along here. Go back here, back here, back here. Parking area. There's the steps to the back door. That's the right off the back driveway that's the walk up into the kitchen kitchen is pretty spacious come around here we hide this side of the door there's a little nook uh, walk down into the basement the basement is bigger than you think but that's the back door we're gonna load our the washer and dryer in through that door and then we got here and then we go up into the kitchen so coming in through the door we just came through, there you, there's this big walk-in slide door, uh, closet kind of pantry thing, and we uh, it goes inside and it's got a little window in there, and it's pretty cool. He's got Nala's cat sit up there, and then off of that is the uh, regular bathroom. It's, it's a side small bathroom, but it's, it's it's bigger than most small bathrooms. It's really cool. Got that one of those nice windows. Got a bathroom, got a toilet, and it flushes. Yeah. Okay, starting at the door, going this way. This is the back wall that we just saw from outside. It goes into here. The uh, side wall of the kitchen. Nice kitchen, great. Nice floors. This is the only room that's not wood, hardwood, but it's a nice little laminate. And then there's Sally. She's been here ever since we moved out. I, I, I think she lives here and they're gonna let her stay because they said she looks like a kindly woman. She's over there doing incredible paperwork. Oh, Such a great job. Back here, I'll take you there in a minute, is the door that goes down into the basement from inside. We'll look at that in a minute. Now back off in the distance, we're gonna go into the house. John is up there serenading with a guitar, checking the acoustics, which is exactly what he said he was gonna do. See if he can check and see how it sounds in here. Recording possibilities. This is going into the mid, like mid room off the kitchen. There's the bay windows I was talking about. So beautiful. Hardwood floors are incredibly beautiful. That goes into the front living room area. We'll go in here. And first of all, this is the stairway. All that nice wood. Nice walk-in closet underneath. I like, this is one thing I really like, is the, at the base here, on the archway going into the living room. There's cubby, there's like French door <sighs> shelving in there. I'll show it to you from the other side. But this is where we're walking into the, the big front living room area. Uh, it's like I said, it's a spacious, beautiful place. That's the front door. We'll go out there in a minute, show you the, that side. But this goes all the way around here. Oh, there's a TV. 
Smell that front, nice front windows. Lots of windows, and it's beautiful scenery here. Um, now we'll go back here. These are what I saw about <laughs> little shelving, glassed in shelves that they're beautiful. And Nala has been climbing up and down in those. She loves this stuff, not in them, but over that. Look at this archway. Look at that archway. Woodwork, beautiful woodwork. It is nice. This is that stairway we were looking at earlier, going up, and there's that kindly lady again. And there's Nala, she loving this place so far. All right, so let's go up the stairs and see the upstairs. Send me this beautiful. Looks like the kindly lady's doing video too. And here's Nala loving it. And that's going in, and that's the bathroom. The bathroom's big, I'll show you in a minute. Uh, this is the hallway going down. There's three main bedrooms. One of them's down there, one of them's right there, and one of them's over here. And Nala says, I approve. Now let's look at this bathroom. This is the master bath. Very nice master bath. And it, she's liking it. She's liking it. It goes around here. Got that back wall. I like all the trim. It's the, the wide old trim. It looks good. Looks cool. Now let's find herself something back here. Oh, there she is. There you are. Look at this. I don't know what that was. They're moving stuff in, I think. Coming off the bathroom, there's the three bedrooms. Go down the hall. This is the bedroom that I have been sleeping in, and Dodge is in there currently. He's, he's just enjoying himself. This is the bedroom. This is probably the smallest of the bedrooms, and it's very big. This would be the second, the middle bedroom. In here. Temporary sleeping last night. These rooms are just nice, man. Look at the nice big walk-in closets. Like I said, it's bigger than what you normally think of as a bedroom. Uh, they look sort of laid out like it. But when you get in, you go, wow, this is a bigger bedroom. Even the small bedroom is about the size of a master bedroom in more, a lot of places. Nice hardwood floors. That's the hall. At the end of the hall is the closet. Pretty good size walk-in closet. Yeah, pretty big. Bigger than most. Very spacious, like I keep saying. Redundant. This one would be considered the master, I think. It's a slightly bigger than the others, a little longer. But every bedroom's got, look at the windows. Just lots of light, beautiful. Out into the neighborhood, you see it. You can see out the neighborhood. Uh, and then coming around here, you got a walk-in closet. <laughs> a kind of unusual shape. You go all the way down to the end of the closet, and then you got one of the windows going on. You even got a, look at that picture. You got a window going through the closet, so you got a nice natural light. All right, this is the stairway in the kitchen next to the refrigerator that goes down into the basement. And we'll show you this basement. Reflect some light, get some light. Kind of a narrow stairway right here, but it's like a, it's a pretty steep walk. I, the only thing to, about, <clears throat> about this down here is that this floor has been, the tile has been ripped up. And But if you put a new regular part of the floor in here, if you could just like laminate it, put on some something. Uh, the room itself down here, with a little work, could be a, a, an apartment almost. You got two rooms off the side. They've got part of it now. They started painting this part. But uh, there's a doorway 
into another whole section where the washer dryer stuff goes. Uh, the washer dryer goes in here, hook up right there. Uh, regular basement kind of stuff here. But you get around here, look how big this is. I mean, you could uh, set up a little studio or something in here, but just real rustic looking cool. Just needs something on the floor. Little work. It doesn't smell musky. It doesn't smell damp. It's like they've they've taken good care of everything. Uh, normal stuff. Coming around this way though, you got the cement wall. Looks great. Someone's tried to damp paint. Uh, washer dryer right there. Comes up here. Obviously, but this the basement is pretty big. Like everything in this. Uh, I think I've said that more than once. So we just backed the U-Haul from across the street, brought it in to the front porch. Perfect, we got the ramp to set up perfect right to the porch, no up and down stairs. And we are about to unload the, the whole trailer. Mm -hmm. 